McDonald works there. Worst food I've ever had. Ricky, what's happening? It's the 18K. They're all over the damn place. They're trying to kill Uncle Poe. <sighs> Shit. Shoot my face off? For some reason, I just don't see that happening.
18K shut off the power. Uncle Poe is on life support. If we don't get backup power running right away, he won't make it. Okay, look, there's a control station down the hall. I'm on it. These guys are beginning to annoy me. Can you lock this place up? I'll take care of it. I got you covered. I'm coming back. Wait, give me a hand.
I think we're clear. That was close. Nice work. No, man. We just got lucky. Where was our backup? Man, who was looking out for us? <sighs> Fuck. No one ever looks out for you in this town. I don't know, man. Feels like the game has changed. It used to be a brotherhood. It was a code. Even amongst rival triads. Now we're killing each other at weddings. Even in a fucking hospital. And for what? Shit. Let's get out of here! More cops! Kiddo, kiddo! We up! People stand to benefit if Uncle Poe never leaves the hospital. He might walk out of there alive. I hope so. When the dog eyes is gone, this shit keeps happening. It might be that someone is pulling strings, trying for a move that lands him in control of the tribe. The 18K are getting out of hand. We have to send them a message. Damn straight. Look, I'll drop you here. The cops might be watching the place. Hey, Ricky. Keep it tight. There aren't that many decent guys left in this gang. All right. All right. See you. Bye.
Well, well, well. Look who decided to join us. Yeah, it's good to see you. Come on in. <laughs> you sure you don't want to fuck her a little before you start? It's no problem at all. I'll just have a swing by your hotel on the way to the studio. <laughs> nah, man, I'm good. But we could do a photo shoot or whatever and look. I'm sure it'd be fun and all, but that's not why I'm here, dude. Ah, you don't know what you're missing. This baby will fuck you in a way your wife never could. Sonny, this is Wei. Wei? The infamous Sonny Wu. <laughs> That's me. Infamous and notorious. Glad you could come by. Ricky's told me all about you. This is King. What's good? He's producing Vivian Liu's next big hit. Yeah, it's gonna be hot, man. Wei here's the real deal. A bona fide tribe killer from the streets. Cleavers, guns, castrations, whatever you want. Okay. <laughs> Wei, why don't you take King out on the town and show him around? Yeah, anytime. It's like one big playground, man. Nothing's off limits. You want to pick up some girls, get nasty, done. And with Wei, no one will bother you. Nobody fucks with Sun on Yi. Yeah, well, I mean, actually, that sounds all right. If you don't mind showing me around. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I wish I could go with you players. But business call. All right, cool, man. Yo, it was real nice to meet you, Sonny. Let's hit the streets. Let's do it. Ricky, listen to this. I've been thinking. We need to get her a movie row of some sort. Hey, I think we'll start at the K bar. The VIP room should give us what we need. Hey, it's your town, man. So you producing for Sonny? <laughs> Just this one time. Man, that guy's a piece of work. Fucking clown, you ask me. <laughs> I'm glad you said it first. Buddy does good business, makes everyone a lot of money. But as far as his personality goes, huh? <laughs> good to know we're on the same page. Fact is, you know, I got some other business to discuss. But I don't think my partners back in the States would want to be in bed with that guy. What kind of business? I got friends, guys I grew up with. They got a real good import and retail thing going. They could use a good Hong Kong and access to that good Asian product. You feel me? That's the reason I took the producing gig was I heard Vivian and her label got connections. Well, they are. To me. Uh, well then, I guess this is gonna be like one of them old school business meetings. You know, when you show me around town and try to figure out if we're a good fit. Good evening, gentlemen. We'd like the VIP karaoke room. It's right this way. Hey, what's new? Yeah, hold on. And don't tell me you and me are gonna sing to each other. I mean, I'm here for the local flavor, but not that long. Let me find us the right kind of audience. Hey there, what's your name? Katushka! I'm Wei. Well, listen, I saw you looking at my friend and I figured you realize he's a famous American celebrity. And I, I just wanted to ask if you mind keeping it a secret. <laughs> Ooh, how can I say no? Well, if you're not doing anything, maybe I can buy you silence with a drink. Want to join us? <laughs> That's very nice of you. So you're from Russia? Yes. <laughs> How'd you guess? Ah, call it a hunch.
Hello, ladies. Hey, Mr. VIP. Want to buy us girls a drink? <laughs> I don't know. My friend and I are going to enjoy your company. Try us on and see what you get. <laughs> All right. Why don't you join my friend and I'll be in in a second. How about you? You okay, miss? Wait, what guy? That my girl, so why don't you fuck her? I'm son on <laughs> oh, yeah! Hey, wait! Hey, come get a picture of this, will you? Way here has been promising me a taste of Hong Kong. Yeah! <laughs> nice! Oh, yeah! Bring it, baby! Come on, let's bounce. And you know what? 
You give good tourists, Ray. <laughs> Where's my town? Least I can do. No way. Don't think I'll forget that, man. Come on, my people will like you, huh? You got the right fare. Too many motherfuckers think all you gotta do is jump bad and wear the right colors. Nah, business is a business. You feel me? You gotta be in it with the right people. Yeah, I can see you fitting right in in the state seat. Yeah. If you ever want to change the scene, I'll keep that in mind. There you are. I've been waiting for you, a stable guy. Stand back. Stand back. You crazy? This is icing on the fucking cake. That's some nasty ass shit you got going on. Remind me not to fuck with you. Alright, so listen. I'm going back in a week or so, alright? I'll tell my boys I got the man for them. Alright. They'll want to start slow, but I'm guessing they can move as much product as you can ship. Oh, this could be huge, man. These boys got some big ideas, too. I'm talking all the legit shit their money goes into. Gotta go somewhere. You feel me? And the feds back home are really cracking down. Brothers might be looking for a little offshore stash. Yeah. And the man who set that up kept it safe. He'd have a whole little agreement to deal with. You feel me? Well, I could swing that for you. I still got contacts stateside who could set up the other side of things. Mm-hmm. Hell yeah. Yo, you ever work in movies, way? Nah, too much bullshit. I mean, look at Sonny Walker. Nah, man. Come on, that's what's good about it. Everybody's a fucking moron. You come in with muscle and money, and you two can call the shots. You got a point. All right, here you go. Thanks, man. I really appreciate it. Really. It's real cool to meet you. We'll see you around. Yeah, for sure. Hopefully first night of many. Well, then. Looks like this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. <laughs> All right, man. Take care.
I found one of your statues. The rooster! Good, good. How are you doing? I'm fine. But the past, I mean. Your past. That's one of those questions you shouldn't ask. Is it? I guess those are the rules. But someone should ask it, even if you ask it of yourself. <laughs> what are you, a Zen master now? Of course. Didn't you know? What would you like to learn? I don't mind you fucking her, it's one of the perks, but she has to understand the consequences if she disappoints me. Are we clear? Of course, Sonny. You're not getting attached, are you? A man of your caliber? You don't need to worry about that. I hope not. Wei, come in, have a drink. You ever fuck some famous pussy, Wei? Not yet, maybe one day. <laughs> it's a trip, man, let me tell you. You drive by one of those billboards the size of a building, and you tell yourself, I'm going to her place, bend her over the table, and mm, and then you do it. There's no other feeling like it. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, speaking of stars, 
I need to go pick up Vivian. Let Way do it. You and I have more business to discuss. How about it, Way? Think you can handle a smoking hot starlet for the day? Uh, sure. I, you know, as long as Ricky doesn't think I'm moving in on his territory. <laughs> nah, of course not. Here, take my car. <laughs> you take good care of my little starlet. Go ahead and fuck her if you want. Just don't damage the goods. Way. Ricky sent me. Didn't he tell you? No, I was expecting Ricky. Everything okay? Everything is not okay. Is it wrong of me to want to see my boyfriend? Why do I have to put up with this? No, Vivi, it's not wrong. And you put up with it because Ricky loves you. But... But what? Since your boyfriend isn't driving, I get to sit in front. <laughs> Why are the bad ones always so good looking? I'm Sandra. What's your name again? It's Way. Ricky talks about him a lot. Oh, all nice things, I'm sure. And you're here to basically do whatever we want? Uh, something like that. What do you have in mind? Hmm. Do you have steady hands at high speed? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I mean, I, I can provide references if you like. Uh, are you trying to talk him into one of those street races you always go on about? Way. You a gangster like Ricky? He's not a gangster, don't say Let's say I'm as much of a gangster as Ricky. Oh, that's too bad. Recently I've wanted to date a gangster. Well, maybe I'll see if I can find one for you. That would be nice. What's Ricky doing anyways? Why is he too busy? I don't know. Something with Sonny. Sonny? That guy's a creep and a perv. It's okay. What? What'd he do? Nothing. But he tried. I was at a party on Wallace Chung's yacht. I was like... That's him, that's him. Pull up. Hi, Alex. How are you? Huh. This is your new boyfriend? Not yet. Why? Are you jealous? Of this guy? Hey. So Sandra says you like to race. How about it? Now, if you win, I'll let you take the girls home. Way? I'm not sure how much that's worth. OK, we race for the girls and 100,000. Sure, I'll take your money too. You racing with the girls in your car? The extra weight will slow you down, idiot. Think of it as your head start, Alex, because you're going to need it. Think of it as your head start. I'll show him. This is gonna be great! All right, all right, all right. Vivian and I won't talk.
heart is beating so fast. Great. <laughs> Steady hands. Gotta give you that. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, get a room, you two. Oh, shit! The police! Oh, cops, perfect. was fun way. <laughs> Thanks. Anytime. Vivi, give Way my number and tell him he can take me out on a second date. <laughs> Sandra says you can take her on a second date if you want. <laughs> yeah, I got that. Thanks. Thanks for taking us out today. It was my pleasure. Now Ricky will lend me his car again. Oh. Yeah, sure. What's going on? My friend Katushka. She's gone missing. Nobody's seen her in a week. Katushka doesn't have a visa. She's... she's illegal. Girls like her go missing all the time, but usually they don't have anywhere to go for help. I'll take it out. Would you? Oh, thank you. 